So welcome back to my channel today and what we are playing is The Sims 4 Generations part number Ooh, I don't know. I think it's part number 21 Must be part number 21 or 22 22 or right, something like that. I don't know but we are here with Kathleen and she's feeling quite frustrated she looks So frustrated and tense and she has been when been getting a lot and a lot of um frustration a lot of a uh, craziness going on in her life the divorce the kids her aging up and she has a lot of drama going on in her life she's just she's not happy so she is about to go ahead and um she's about to lose all her money because her daughter found out that she stole her purse and then she stole some money from leo and yeah so I'm going to go ahead and put that little money cheat in and actually get rid of her money because she doesn't really own it. So let's go ahead and uh, put the little money cheat in. Money. She lost about a lot of money. So she only owns about like 4,000 simoleons to her name. So she's... Oh, snap. See, already... She's on money 4,000. Yeah, so she only has 4,000 4, simoleons to her name and she is just... Just going crazy. She's about to age up into an adult. Her sons, her both of her sons are aging up into four days. Ross is about to move out. Anthony is going to be the only kid in the house until, because because he's going to be alone in this house and he might pass out and go crazy. I don't know what he's going to feel like. So let's go ahead and just get started with this and see what she thinks. And uh, Kathleen, she wants to, well, she wants to get married to, what's his name again? Um, Yuhan, and it's quite funny, Rossi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go ahead and go to school and go to school. So, and Leo, he's an elder. I forgot Leo was a flipping adult when they got married. So, Leo's an elder now, and he's quite old, and he's gonna be a. He's already a grandfather, and he's already a. He's already. Oh gosh, and so. They, yeah, so this is just quite hard and for him. Why are you arguing with your soon-to-be husband, huh? She works in two days and she came home with, like, she performed poorly at work yesterday. So she's not doing all that great. So let's go ahead and have, um, let's go and invite Yuhan over. You're going to come over? I'll be right over. So let's see what this is. Anthony has completed his homework. Oh. Not that far. Okay, he's not. He's still good, but he is hungry. But he is hungry. What is Ross doing? Ross is still doing his homework. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, it might be the wallpaper. That's what what it is. Yeah, I don't. I think because this house is not on the gallery. Because I figure, I'm trying to figure out why there's custom content in this, and I'm really not sure why, but. Ross needs to go to school and I need to figure out what's going on, how I can like figure this out. There's Anthony's birth certificate. Oh, there's Yuhan playing. I was like, play nope, he's playing with himself. No, he's outside doing some sit-ups. That's what she needs in, in life. And if you guys have not seen this um, speed build of this house, you can go ahead and check it out on my channel. It is, it has two parts to this, so you can always check out those. Get to know him a little bit better. You want to hug someone, okay. You want to call someone on the phone. You can do that later. But now, Yuhan's still here. They're stuck in the ba- They're stuck See in the bathroom. Be. Get out! That is unsanitary. Get out. There we go. Get out together. Thank you, Yuhan. Sit on the couch that I placed- I said sit, sit together. We have to do everything. Goodness gracious. <sighs> Yuhan's like, yep. Boy. Let's go ahead and have a deep conversation no, with him. So we don't want to talk about alpacas. Pony. Make out. Go Let's go and make a move. Where is it? I just saw it, but it's in the way. Um, I think we should ask him, ask him to move in. Because that'd be kind of cool for her to have him move in together. And be able to have someone in her life not to go crazy. Let's go ahead and have 
That's an excellent move, and see if it, he accepts. I hope he accepts this. If he doesn't, I'm gonna cry. So, Spelling Bee 8. It's a, it's a school Spelling Bee, and Anthony has made to the final round. Oh, gosh. I keep on getting this thing all the time. Oh, gosh. Mm. Anthony's pretty smart in school, but if he accepts the help. Oh, gosh. I'm gonna close my eyes. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. So I think I chose the when he got help. So, so you got small performance out there. I just kiss him for days. Dang, dang. You gonna kiss again? I guess not. Okay, whatever. Was it move in together? Oh, he said yes. Okay, that's pretty awesome. Pretty happy. Pretty happy now. So glad that he asked, he said he accepted our offer to move in. Because she will go legit crazy if she doesn't have one and doesn't have a man in the house to keep control of. Oh my gosh, she is just going to go ballistic, ballistic crazy. And I want Caitlyn to try for a baby, but um, I will I will leave that up to you guys. If she, Caitlyn should have another child in her life. Because I really don't know. I really don't know if that, that should happen or not. But let's go and have Yuhan move in. Let's go and sell all his furniture. Because he doesn't need any of yeah, He does not need any of that. Let's see how much money she gets now. Let's see how much money she gets now from this from this person. So they are both in the same career. So they go both of this. They work together. And that's pretty cool. Pretty excited to see what happens in their life, and I want to get I want them to get married, and um, I'm not really sure if she's gonna walk down the altar and call off the wedding. I don't know. They're not even engaged yet, but I might have Yuhan pop the question in this part. I mean, I, I really want her to get engaged and get married, cause she's gonna probably die alone and have several cats. I really don't know. Probably by the time she dies, I'll we'll have pets. So, yeah, and she'll be a crazy cat lady with a drinking problem. I want her to live that long. I really do. I really want Caitlyn to la to live that long. If that doesn't happen, I'll bring her back to life and make her an elder and make her a crazy cat lady. Then she'll die. So, <laughs> either way, I I want that to happen. <laughs> oh, Yuhan and Caitlyn Ballard. That doesn't sound right. But I don't know. So now we have Yuhan and Caitlyn. They are moved in together. So who does he know? He knows Nita Caliente. He knows Alicia Field. He hates Danielle. Fawn. Oh, the workforce dislikes her so much. She wants a... Okay, that's just lovely. That's just poppy. Or poppy. Hmm. That's just lovely. Um, let's see. Stands out, stands his ground. He can't risk his own grip after. after. Wait, what? What? What just happened? I don't know. I don't even know what happened. Oh well. Well, I'm gonna have them probably just both work hard. Well, study hard at school so I can get their grades up. Cause I want him to be have an A in school, be the top of his class, and graduate with honors. I'm gonna have him study hard. I'm gonna have Anthony make some friends. Let's see. Um. What? Johnny's. Oh gosh. Johnny says, "Don't come by. Where are you at, Johnny? Johnny Bravo? Johnny Bra oh, ladies, just run around naked. Where's Johnny Bravo? Oh no, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh no, Johnny, no." Johnny, go away. Get away from my conversation. I'm about to fight you. I will fight you. You know what? We're going to fight him. Where is this at? We're going to fight him. Mean. Where is it? We're going to mock his outfit. We're going to just be mean to him. Legit mean. Oh, gosh. I'm just... I hate you, Johnny Zest. Get out of here. We're going to jeer him, insult him, give him the cold shoulder. I just can't stand Johnny Zest. Johnny Bravo needs to go away. Yay! Hate! Hate! Woo! I hate him so much! Let's go ahead and scare him. 
Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, that was fight, fight. Okay. He's like, I'm not impressed. Get out of my face. So you need to solve three cases. Oh, level six? Oh my gosh. He's in the fight. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Go, Caitlyn, go! Go, Caitlyn, go! Oh no, what just happened? Did she win? She win? Why are you sick? From watching fight. The old oh, stomach is not feeling so good. Will you, hon? Don't you feel so terrible? Go do something about it and go eat some food or throw up. Well, work out. What are you doing? This, you know, go and load the dishwasher, why don't you? But Caitlyn, she feels confident. Because she won a fight. So she feels great. So I'm happy. And Anthony met Darren at school. We're just going to keep on yelling at Johnny's S tier today. Um, throw a drink at his face. Please do. Please throw a drink. It's like, what? Oh, for laughing at me. We're, gonna, we're just going to fight you again. Right? Can we just fight you again, please? Rush him off. Oh, we are going to declare him as an enemy. Please. Declare enemy. Please do. You, Johnny Zest, Bronny, Johnny Bravo, you're an enemy now. We're enemies. I hate you. So get the on my face. If we can miss, I don't think so. Yell at him. Can we just, can we kill him? Oh gosh. Wow, let's go and... Oh, you're yelling at me? So she's very angry and she has a new enemy. She's had an aggravated conversation from the hot-headed trait. Just lovely. Rent and rave. Rent and rave. Insult his face. Provoke. Is there an option to kill him? Is there a mod for that? Please, in the comments below, let me know. Is there a mod to kill off people? Because I really want to know. I really want to kill Johnny That's So bad. So bad. Let's fight him again. This is so bad. I just... Oh gosh. Caitlin, why? Caitlin, why? Fight him. What? He's in the way? Fight him? Chew him out. Provoke him. Provoke. And fight him. Again. Fight. Fight. Gosh, I don't like you. She's gonna probably die from angerness. That's probably what's gonna happen. Well, Yuhan, we can actually have you. Oh, your needs are fine. Fine and dandy. Well, we might have you go on a date. Oh, yes. The fight is on. Who's going to win? Caitlin, you going to win? Yes. Yes. She won again. And why are you happy for some reason? Well, we're just going to actually have you. Let's see. I have him go away. Just get out of my get off my property. You don't belong here. I need you to leave. Johnny Zest, please. Thank you. Sir. You're a disgrace. Um, sir. You're still on my property. Please leave. We're gonna have to fight you again. You're on like on our property. Uh go ask him to go away. I said go away. Go away. Get off my property. You see this land? You're on it. Now go away. If you don't go away, we have to we have to fight you again. I'm gonna follow him. I'm gonna follow him. Yeah. Leave Johnny. Oh my gosh, Johnny. I'm gonna have to kill him. I'm gonna have to kill him. What I have to do? So that's pretty great. And um I might just go ahead and skip off when Actually, no, I'm gonna, um, go ahead, you, Han. Oh, uh, Caitlin, actually, you need to go ahead and have your nice, uh, nice, um, please don't yell at Blarfy. You already hate him enough. Go ahead and have yourself a nice cold shower so you don't punch somebody in the face. Like you did with Johnny Zest. And then we're gonna have you, Han, go ahead and ask Caitlin on a date to see if that rolls in motion. Pretty, pretty hope, I hope so. And, let's see, how is he doing? He feels tense, but he's gonna 
he's getting some amusement, so he's good there. He's good, but he just needs some fun. Anthony, you are fine. Let's go and have you do your homework for now. And then we need to have you do your... Where's your homework? Where'd you leave your homework? Ross, where, where's your homework? Where is your homework? Can't find it. Where is it? Where is it at? Where'd you... Oh my gosh, did he lose his homework? Oh my goodness gracious. Ross, why? Ross! Oh, no, no, mind. It's right here. You left it on your little thing. Taking a cold shower? She's still flipping angry. Great. So let's go and have Yuhan come downstairs. And she, he might pop the question in this part. Not sure. Let's go and ask him on, ask on a date. Ross, do your homework. Yuhan, ask on a date. So she doesn't feel all flipping angry about it. She just, hopefully she says yes. Ross seems to be happy about uh, about you and moving in and seems peachy fine about it. Hopefully, Anthony feels good about it too. If he doesn't, then he has to, has to suck it up and uh, yeah. Either way, he has to suck it up. So let's go actually let's head over to um, Oasis Springs. I don't think I'm placing like new lots on here. It seems all the same. This is quite bad because I need new. I need to place new lights on here. Like this is pretty old. That's pretty old. Um, where is it at? Uh, that's not nothing new. Okay, guys. So here we are at the night, uh, the country club here, and we are on a date. So I think Caitlin has to the next level. So go on two dates. So once this thing is done, she'll go to the next level. Johnny Zest, you don't belong here. Thought I killed you. That's, apparently he's invincible. Okay, that's just lovely. Let's go ahead and flirt with the with um Yuhan for a few. Flirt with him. Let's see. Hug. <laughs> then we can swabe. Yes, swabe. Let's. What else can we do? Flirt. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, why are you so sad, mystery guy? Who are you, mystery guy? Why do we hate you? Vincent... Did his wife leave him? That's why he's just like a bum? Guess so. Knew it was too big to be true. Um... Okay, we flooded with him. Okay, now we gotta sit together. Let's sit together, friend. Go over here together. So they're both flirty. That's pretty great. I'm pretty happy that they're flirty. So, flirty mood, flirty babies. So, yeah. So if you guys want Bennett, Bennett, no. So if you guys want Caitlyn and Yuhan to get married and have children, just leave, leave them in the comments below. And today is actually Caitlyn's birthday, so she'll be aging up in this part. Bennett, go away. I don't want to talk to you, you little hobo. Sit and talk together. Sit and sit and talk to your date. So let's go and complain about work. He he knows the struggles about being a police officer, about working in the police force. Then we have to kiss our date. Um, be enticing. Tell a story. Tell a doggy story. Um, oh cool, they're good friends. Blow a kiss, and then we can. He's not even wearing proper attire. Um, so let's do a passionate kiss. Kiss your date. Did that count as a kiss? I don't think it did. Dang. Um, flatter. I'm trying to socialize with our date like flipping eight more times. Discuss color theories. Bennett, you need to get out of the conversation, please. Oh my gosh. Bennett, if you don't leave, I have to fight you too. What's going to happen? What's she gonna do? <gasps> oh, wow! Oh, he's like, I can't get another day. Can't get enough of that. So we got that out of the way. It's pretty awesome. What else? Give it a sexy pose. Then we gotta tell him a story. Dang! I might have him pop the question. I don't know. 
Discuss color theories. Brighten his day. It's a lot of interactions there. Hey, 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 hey. Let's ask him about his day. See how he was doing since they were still home together. Either way, you never know his day was bad, good, great, ugly. You never, you never know. You never know what can happen in a day. I never know what can happen in a day. Let's go next and take a picture together. And then we can. But hopefully, I hope Caitlyn actually has a good life with her, with Yuhan, because Leo was just like a phase, and she just did not like him at all. He had money, so she took the opportunity and went for it, literally. She went for it, had three kids with them, then got divorced. That was just lovely. So, inside joke. So hopefully, Yuhan, Yuhan is the one, and they'll stay together forever. Bennett, get out of the conversation. Bennett, I hate you. Get out. But I'm going to keep on going until this date is over. And then I'll end the part here. Surprise, I recorded all the way through. So, without stopping. Kind of. But with some pause. I don't care. So, that count as socialization. No. I want my mango to be done. I have five more. Five more. Uh, Get to know him a little better, so we can know all his know all his traits. Tell a funny story. And how do we give him a massage? And is that romantic? Um. Oh, offer massage. Okay, cool. You not you needs to go to the bathroom. <gasps> Bennett left. Yes. Finally, a nice, good conversation to ourselves. So, we told a story. And who else would deep conversation? What the what the clickety clap? Talk about cooking. Become partners in oh, yes, partners in crime. Where become best friends? Where was the part? Yes, partners in crime. Yes, do it now. What I saw seven. That was it. Went down to six. Okay, he's going to the bathroom now. That's good. Go ahead and go to the bathroom before you peeing yourself, so you don't have a. Nah. Oh no. Don't don't pee on yourself. Don't do it. Don't do it, Yuhan. Okay, go ahead and use the bathroom really quick. For your, before your date ends. Like literally, I don't want this date to end at all. And then we can go ahead and uh, let's see. Discuss interests. Ask about date, become best friends. Caitlin, don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. We're almost done peeing. Caitlin. Caitlin. Take she says grab a drink and everything will be fine. Oh, coffee. That's that's interesting. Yuhan, move it with a purpose. Yuhan. Yuhan, okay, good. This all count. Share a secret. Oh, eight. Eight. Okay. Two more. Two more. Okay, one more. Uh, ooh. Oh, I'm so close, so close. Become best friends. <gasps> Wait, what was that? What was that? I don't know what that was. Oh, became best friends. That's very nice. That's really great. And then, that didn't count. Dang. Deep conversation. And then we can go ahead and do a, let's X about his day. See, I want to see if that works. I want to know if it works with him. Please work. Don't go away. I want, I want a medal. Flipping, flippity crap. Dang. We didn't even get a date unsuccessful. That's just lovely. Why is he flipping squeamish? Um, let's go ahead and have him pop the question now. Oh. Let's see. Better with old friend. Nope. Let's go ahead and get on one knee. And propose. <laughs> okay, here we go. Moment of truth. To Caitlin Ballard. Will you marry me? Hmm? Will you? Click yes. 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 Ah, that big rock. Thank you. I love it. So now, Caitlin and Yuhan are both engaged to be married. It's just lovely. She is in that phase of... 
She wants children now, so he's insane. I forgot about that. Dang. So, Yuhan just got engaged to Caitlyn, and this is just pretty great. Now, let's show how you can af afford that ring with the salary he's getting per hour. But, oh well. Oh well, that's the sim world for you. We can go and blow a kiss, and then... I think what I'm going to go and do is actually end this part off right here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to comment down below all your um your suggestions if you Han and Caitlyn should get married at the altar or should they elope and should they have children together or not. So, I will see you guys next time.